Welcome back from the break, guys. Welcome, Inspiron, to the stream. Inspiron, I have streamed... This day is Sunday, by the way. Sunday, UTC. I have streamed this day every week for the last seven or eight months. So, I don't know how you missed that, but that's that's what's up. Anyway, let's go investigate this, uh, this queen. Uh, first of all, let's go to Daggerfall. And find the the old queen. By ship. Seven days by ship. Nice. What are my uh, my old boots? Hold on. My old boots were just seal boots plus four. Eh, just drop them. All right, let's go. First of all, here. Okay, where's the the, the castle is way up there. Let's visit this place on the way past, so let's head north. No problem, Inspiron. I imagine you thought it was Saturday. Because of s something to do with school that you're mentioning there. Oh, good gravy, it's, it's hot in here. It's getting hot in here. So keep your clothes on and just bear it. I am getting so hot, but I'm gonna remain fully clothed. <laughs> Let's perhaps stop by this fighter's guild and train some of our stuff. The Knights of the Dragon. Open at 11. So five hours from now or so. Let's find the front door. Okay, loiter for three hours, till it's nine something, 9.20ish, then loiter for another two, till it's 11.20ish, show me your pixels. Oh, phantom, oh, phantom. Alright, where's the trainer? You there. Maybe I can't use the trainer, actually, because I'm not in the guild. That is probably the case, now that I consider it. There's a smith, yep. And here's the trainer through here. No? There's a houseman. No trainer? Okay. I know there was one door I missed, but it goes outside of the place. So let's head west, and perhaps a bit more north, I think. Maybe. I'm not sure, really. Yeah, it is. It is north. There it is. Castle Daggerfall. Okay, in we go. Let's find who we're looking for. Wow, what just happened? What the? There's something through there. Um. I already did this quest, and I received my reward. Um, oh, it's not even giving me the information that that guy gave me. Oh. Yes. So let's find the, um, the queen, the old queen. No. No, you're not a queen, certainly. This woman, maybe. I don't have time for your type. Well, that's probably her, but she doesn't have time for us, so let's just leave. 
and instead go to I can't remember what it was called we're gonna have to load in to when we were talking to that guy the Isle of Balfiera okay thank you and then we still got the same fortification I hope yes the Isle of Balfiera I wonder if it's in Sentinel. Hmm. Isle of Balfiera, here it is. Huh. And it's probably in the center there. Um, if I can... Dereni Tower. Singbury. Kingston Farmstead. Coppering Orchard. Yomhart Graveyard, Blackhead, Shrine of Vigril, Joad Shrine, Upvale, The Crypts of Mastersmith, The Crypts of Kingham, The Buckingham Farmstead, The Yom House Cemetery. We better check these places before we go to one of them. Gearsmith Orchid. This Sing Brew, the Morehouse Farmstead, Kingsley Orchid, Gallo Market, the Ashton Crips. There's another one there, wasn't there? I don't know. The Ashmouth Farmstead, Warwick, the Gear House Plantation, and Old Little Farm. So I'm pretty sure it's this place here, the Rennie Tower. The Rennie Tower is the Adamantine Tower. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Do I want to go there now? I want to go there, I think. I'm not sure that I do now that he said that though. Is that a bad thing? I'm getting the, the feeling that that's a no. That it's actually a bad place to go. But we're going to try it anyway. I'm guessing I'm just going to get raped up the bomb. By this place. But we'll see. So we can save over these ones. Let's just say 256. That's what we're up to. Let's just go in. So there's the end. Oh dear. Well, that looks like a promising direction already. Wow. Those are some. I can't tell if they're beautiful from over here. They don't look beautiful, no. They're like undead. What is happening? Am I being attacked by invisible people? Wow! The Wraith. The tower was destroyed during the Oblivion Crisis. Thank you for that. This lock has nothing to fear for me. We'll see about that. Aha! Wow, that was what was at the top of this huge place. Oh shit, I just fell. Wow, I didn't even die. Is that my luck? Shoes helping me out there? A ghost. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. I hope this is the right place. Come on. Bash it. Darn it. Aha, there we go. Wow, there was nothing in here. Oh. Did that do anything helpful? Maybe not. It looks like there's stairs behind here. Somewhere. I don't know. Did you miss much? Your internet died. I'm not sure, Virulent Pumpkin. I'm not sure when you left. 
When your internet died, I should say. But I'm currently in Adamantine Tower or something, or something like that. And I don't really know where it is, or if I'm in the right place. Or what's in here. I'm just hoping it's where the sorceress is. 57. Kinda hoping it's not, to be perfectly honest. Because this place is crazy! This is a vampire, isn't it? Oh my god. Okay. Isn't that another vampire that I hear? Where is she? Beautiful vampire. Deadly, but beautiful. Oh dear! Ghost. Oh, what is this horrible? This place is not fun. Hey, that puns guy, welcome. Is that? It's a golden poppy, I don't need that. I only want the roses, please. Oh, down here? I don't want to do that. Do we YOLO climb? Bro, do you even YOLO? Because I YOLO, as you can tell. This is pretty freaking YOLO. Oh man, I'm not thinking this is going to go well. I'm going to fall down and die. Oh my god. These are not attractive at all. Oh my god. That was a mistake. Oh god, it's a vampire. Is that a KKK hat? No, it's a toga. Okay. Oh man. Oh my god, another vampire. She looks terribly sunburnt, actually. Maybe that's just a skin tone. Oh my god, stop it. Stop! Okay. Oh, I leveled up. That's good. That's not bad. That's not a bad thing, amazingly. Um, I really just want willpower, to be honest, boost my mad resist. I feel like my other stats are high enough. But my willpower is seriously lacking because spells still almost one-shot me. So let's boost that. Is it possible to stream to both Twitch and YouTube at the same time, Dallas Chiefs fan? Yes it is, but not from the same program. You can't take OBS and set it to stream to both. Uh, but you can take another instance of OBS and set it to stream to both. Or, my recommendation would to be, because that is going to take a ton of CPU processing power to, to do that. If you have enough internet to do it, you could stream to one service, then have another computer that watches your stream and then just restreams it. Which will lower, which will lose a bit of quality, but it'll get to both, uh, both services without affecting your primary streaming computer too terribly much. Now let's climb this thing and kill these things. There's another vampire down there, I think, but we'll we'll go up here first and try to murder these things. If you have fast enough internet is what I meant by that. Are these things not? There was something up here shooting me, wasn't there? Oh dear, I'm, just, I'm in the wall now. Oh shit! Well... Oh, we're back at the entrance. Good god. I don't like this place at all. Oh! This is not a happy place. So that's the entrance. Where's the thing that's laughing? It's not humorous at all. Oh my god, this place is horrific. 
Uh-huh. Oh my god. This is stressing me the shit out. Oh man. Let's just save over these two. 259. Ah! Save versus all those spells from my willpower, thank god. Well, thank my luck. My luck roll is actually extremely high now that I think of it. So, I'm gonna get lots of saves from luck and from wisdom. Combined, they are very, very, very high. My god. Sorry for breathing directly into the mic there, guys, but good god. This game. So friggin' stressful. Oh man. Okay, see ya soon, Phantom. Oh god. There was something in this room. Oh. Oh, come on. Please die. Thank you. Oh, dear. So I, I'm supposed to go this way first, but there's a big box and there's nothing. Okay. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, my God. Some of these levels look like Doom or Rise of the Triad levels. Yeah, I can, I can see the Doom. I've never played Rise of the Triad, Triad but... I can definitely see where you get the doom. Hold on, I need to change the key binding. My th my pinky is getting so sore pressing the run button. Um, alt and then shift. Alt, 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 alt. Oh dear. Ooh, what is this? Nothing. Why is it just a prop? Frustrates me when that's not an important quest item. Oh my god! See, I hear all these terrible creatures and then just see a rat and I don't know what's going on. Oh dear. Oh dear. I don't like this place. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Oh man. Come on. Why are there no creatures? I don't want to go through that. Yet. It's probably a portal. Oh! Oh dear. Oh dear. It's fun to just stare at my cums for a while, it's like I'm in a centrifuge. <laughs> nice. Oh, this game, this game. So stressful. Okay. Okay. Let's just drop these boots because I'm wearing the sandals now. Oh my god. What is this? A black poppy, that's pretty cool, but we don't want it. Uh. Wow! I was a fool! You were a fool to confront me! And now, I ah! the ultimate trap! Oh, good gravy.
This freaking game, man. This freaking game. I didn't save for a little while, so we've got a little while to run. Did I s change the controls? Yes, good. Oh! Damn ghosts. Oh, this game. And then we went back. Oh, shit. Oh! Thank me for not borrowing OpenNerd's song. <laughs> of course. No problem. I'm actually thinking of, um, thinking of, uh, extending that. Right now I have the top donation sound as the whole, You were a fool to confront me, and now I've paid the ultimate price. Even now my servants go to m fetch your mortal husk. You will serve me well as emperor, once I have na raised you undead. Perhaps I will even let you retain some of your memories, so that the price of your failure has meaning to you. I might take that entire thing and make that my death sound. Because, I don't know, it's pretty cool. It's a, it's a, it's a pretty cool, it's a pretty cool. Uh, it is a pretty cool. Sorry, by the way, I'm, I'm speaking quite quietly, but I'm friggin... I don't know what the word is to describe. What I'm feeling. But it's not good things. Sort of a... Sort of a... Dread. With fear. And... Stress. And... Stuff like that. Oh, it's on. Hold on. I just figured out my, my keyboard was like jiggling around. It was on top of my keys and my <laughs> my mouse cord. Oh, good gravy. Nobody, nobody coming. Whoops, nobody coming. I should open. Come on, come on. Whoops. Actually, as soon as I moved my keyboard there, it starts to hurt my arm with the way it rested. Come on, bash it open. Bash her open. Come on. Pull a Chris Brown and bash this door open. There we go, thank you. And nothing in here but this portal. We need to sleep and we can't with enemies nearby. Oh. Money. Just give me the money and leave me be. Nope. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh no, this is the room. This was the room where I died, right? Okay. Ah! Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Ah! Oh. Bollocks, I'm paralyzed, I'm paralyzed. I can I can get out of this though. Is it going to cast? And I'm paralyzed, I'm still paralyzed. Shit. Oh wait, it's unrestrainable, sorry. I was casting the wrong one. Thank you. Let's flee quite a distance. Oh! Oh shit. I'm almost dead. One hit from anything and I'm dead, I think. Shit. Okay. Please, let me fully rest. Where did I save? 
right in front of the door. Let's just save over this one each time we do some damage to him. Or her, judging by the laughing. Oh my god. Oh shit. Okay. Come on. This is some kind of like... Demon Lord thing. It's like the most powerful thing I've fought. There's a lich and I killed it. Does shutting doors help in sleeping? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. I can't believe I still have these boots. We killed the lich. I can't believe it. I don't want to fight another one. Please. Please don't make me fight another one. Let's save it now that we fought and defeated that one. Oh, because there's going to be more. No doubt. What is through here? Oh, little limp. Cute little limp. Oh dear. Okay. Oh, I don't like this. Do not appreciate the audio effects in this game. Man. Thanks, Ikorek, for the follow, by the way. Oh, man. You guys are going to really... I hope you guys are enjoying this, because I'm not. Really. <laughs> I'm not pleased right now. I hope you guys, if you guys enjoy this, you're gonna you're gonna be glad when I move on to oh shit, play Amnesia. I'm gonna play Amnesia: The Dark Descent. I did promise I would, so it was a mistake to promise that, but I'll do it. So yeah, I hope you guys look forward to the same thing as what I'm doing right here, being a massive pansy when I eventually get up to playing that. Oh god. Oh my god. Why? Okay, vampire. Come on. Come on through. Why are you not coming through? Oh god. There we go. <sighs> oh. Let's run back a bit and sleep, maybe. Nope. Oh. Run back a bit further and sleep, maybe. I forgot which key it was to sprint for a second there. But let's do it. Let's do it. It's simple. We kill the woman who, who lives here. Right? Isn't that what we do? What made me choose Red Guard? Well, I wanted to be in Arena. I, uh, I chose Red Guard. Because I wanted to be a spell sword. I already knew that I wanted to be a spell sword. And then he was called Gareth Hogrand. With the help of my, uh, my viewers here, we chose the name Gareth Hogrand. And um, then I decided, I hadn't decided that yet, but I decided once I got a little bit into Arena that I would make each character in my Elder Scrolls Marathon a descendant of Gareth Hogrand. So, this guy right here is Miyamoto Hogrand. It doesn't make sense that he has a Japanese name, but don't worry, he's got the same last name and he's a Red Guard. So he's a descendant of Gareth Hogrand. And my eyes are really hurting, I think. It smells like oranges. It's like, maybe orange body spray or something. Like getting into my eyes. What is with the different things today? First it smelled like cigarettes and now I've got oranges in my eyeballs. It's not a good day for my eyes, I don't think. Oh my nose. Oh, wow, okay. We've come full circle. We have come full circle. Let's go back now. And what we're going to do is go... Oh, we haven't even been this way, so never mind. We'll just go this way. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on. 
Whoops. Okay. Oh. Oh, don't make those noises, please. It's been a long time since we've heard the dubstep. The 90s dubstep. We don't want to hear it again. I don't want to be in this place anymore. Can't I just play? Oh, God. I dodged all of that. Wow. <laughs> okay, that was pretty sweet. That was pretty sweet. You must admit. Where is this guy? Is he up? Ah, must be up there somewhere. Oh, or maybe right here. Here we go. Oh man. Oh dear. Wait, vampires cast spells at me now? Oh, she just fell down, I think. Oh shit. I really don't take that much damage from falling now. I used to take a ton. Okay, please let me back up. Nope. Oh man, oh man. Oh shit. I just jumped off again. Why would I do that? Am I an idiot? Maybe. Maybe I'm just an idiot. Oh shit, I'm on top of it, aren't I? I think I just got on top of that vampire right there. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Let's just walk over to it. Am I hitting it now? No. Okay. Here we go. I'm hitting it, right? Yes. There you go. Glitchy as hell and all that, but as long as we get the job done. Oh, man. Oh, dear. I got stuck there for a second. You forgot if I answered, am I going to play Red Garden Battlespire? No, I'm not. I'm not playing Red Guard or Battlespire. I might some other time, but not during this marathon, certainly. I've never even really seen any media on them, so I don't know very much about the games at all. Uh, 264. This dungeon is giving you anxiety and you're not even playing? I think that's me giving you anxiety. <laughs> I think I'm giving you anxiety, not the dungeon. I think if it were anybody else playing. Just cruising through, having a good time. You'd be, you'd be enjoying a nice cup of tea and some biscuits over in Texas. That's what Texans do, right? Tea and biscuits. Isn't that what they're famous for? I think so. I don't think I've, I don't, I don't think I've misstepped there at all. Okay, let's just go back out here now and climb up. And perhaps we shall move on through here. Oh, if we've, we've been here. What is the difference between Nightbot and Moobot? They're both different uh, chatbots. Yes, I do believe Froggy lives in Texas. That's what she said I was giving her anxiety. And uh, then I brought up the Texas thing and all that. Is this the main chamber? Please be the main chamber. Ah! Okay. I don't like this game, really. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't want to play it. Beer and guns. No, I, I, yeah, tea and biscuits, number one. Tea and biscuits, number one. Whoops, I didn't even take the money. Did I? What did I take? Oh, I can't carry. What is this? Reversible tunic. But I'm wearing that badass thing that gives me massive reinforcement. Let's just remove that. Whoops. What did I just take? What is this? Indulce it, remove it. What is this? Restore power. Oh, I'll just remove it. And give me the money. Okay. 
Oh dear. <sighs> well, there's the stairs up. Oh man. Ah. No, thank you. In we go. Yola. Let's hit this thing first. No, it's nothing. Yola. I guess. Oh shit. Oh please. Please die. There we go, now we're sinking. So we can hit them. Oh! Welcome back Phantom Darkness Dasher. Brisket is not equal to biscuit. <laughs> oh you guys, you guys. Honestly, Texans are most famous for being morbidly obese. Wow. I hope you're a Texan, Dallas. I mean, I don't mean that as to say you're. A, I hope you're obese, but to insult Texans like that, damn man. Who was opening doors in this place? It was it was this door, wasn't it? Oh my god. Oh. Climbing mode, really? I'm underwater, for goodness sake. Okay, Drew is dead. Drew Carey is dead, I killed him. You've lived in Texas for 20 years. And let me guess, you're 20 years old. No, I joke, I joke. Actually, come to think of it, you have mentioned school before. So, I guess you're in university. Stream offline? No, Verlip Pumpkin. I'm going to check that that link works. Yeah, it does. Often, uh, a stream works when it's embedded and not... When it's, uh... Oh, you're only 20 years old. Well, there you go. Yep. Yep. There you go. Nothing. Nothing else in... Oh, what is this? What's this? What's this? A secret hidden lever. What's this? What's this? Uh, maybe I can get out of this place. What's this? What's this? I really hate this place. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, it flicked this up? Oh, so each room is going to have a lever that I missed. Jolly good. Welcome, Virulent Pumpkin. Welcome back, I should say. Oh, another Drew in here. Oh, it's a zombie underwater, of course. Because what could be better than an underwater zombie? That's what I wanted in my game. I can't carry any more money. I'm weighed down with all this gold in my pockets. First world problems. Oh, there's the lever. Come on, there you go. Okay, time to save. By the way, guys, I'm just saving and reloading to refresh my breath. It fills up your breath bar if you save and reload. Totally not a cheat at all. But I'm doing it, though. I am, though. I am cheating, though. Just for that, that's the one thing I'm cheating about in this game. Oh, is that a way down? No, it's just a glitch. Isn't it? Yep. Go to my bank and wait in Wayrest? Yeah, I know. I will. I will. There we go. I will return to the bank at some point. There we go, get my breath back. Get me my breath back. Okay, we need to... Now the stairs are in the way. What's a bastard. Okay, now take me back down. I'll go get the last lever. Hacker. Uh, Dallas Chiefs fan rage face is not what you want. It's swift rage. 
Swift Rage, capital S, capital R. Is what you're looking for there, I think, Dallas. For the guy going, oh. Okay. Oh, that one, yes. River Dusk's Dan Rage, exactly. I disabled better Twitch TV emotes because it replaces ones with the... with the... With the... Um, what is it? The battery one. Twitch Turbo, there you go. I don't like those ones. Oh, shit. Well, can I just climb this then, please? Maybe? Climb me. Climb! Climb, my boy. Nope. Go on. Move. Am I stuck? I think I'm stuck. I am stuck. Oh, no, I'm not. Now I'm unstuck. Excellent. You're not subscribed to Dan, but he has undeniably the best emotes. I think you're right about that. Okay, let's just get up here. What? Bollocks. And now I'm going through the floor. The glitches! The glitches! Oh. My god! Please, please. Oh, that's the wrong one. I saved while I was up here. Okay. That's good. Okay, I made it onto this platform amazingly. Now, save the game. What was jump? Okay, there we go. Okay. Daggerfall, please. Please don't glitch me. Save 270. Okay, we made it again. Oh, piss. What? Somehow. Okay. I'll take that. I'll accept that. Don't glitch me. Oh, you piece of shit. I'm so stressed about this game. This game is so stressful. It's so stressful. Oh good. Why this game? Why? Why must this game be as it is? Thank you, Salucci, who just donated uh, $10 in my name to myself. <laughs> oh, Salucci. Salucci, uh, just so you know, I did a donation to OP Nerd last night, and I told him to thank you. And he actually thought it was just you donating to him, so... Yeah, quite a sizable donation. So thank you for the donation, Salucci. The $10 donation. But I was totally not a fool. I have not paid the old price. Was it? No, that wasn't even Salucci. Damn it! 
Damn it, Dallas Cheese fan. Was it? Wait. Oh yes, it was Saluchi. It's my damn emails that confuse me. So it, was, it really was Saluchi. It really was. <laughs> oh, this game has totally thrown me off. This game has totally thrown me off. Saluchi, you weren't there. You weren't there last night. Or were you? I don't know. Hey, Forvash Forvashna. If you were there last night, you would have been like, yes, Opina deserves all the monies. Hey, oh, I, I, I can't carry more money. Oh, great, water again. Oh, okay, it's just a torch. Oh, a oh, mermaid. Oh, she's beautiful and she has titties, but she must die. Lamia. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that commentary during that. That was not good. That was not good commentary. You're not going to lie to me. After playing Outlast, this shit looks like My Little Pony. Yeah, I know. I haven't played Outlast, but I've seen some of it. And by the gods, I will never play that game. I can't believe I agreed to play Amnesia, which I'm, I, I am going to... I'm going to go with... I, I, made, I, I gave you my word I would, but... Oh, I regret making that promise. You think Amnesia is worse than Outlast? Don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. What? Is this not a climbable wall? Well. I swear I should be able to just walk up the, that. It looks like I should just be able to walk up. Oh, we'll just climb this wall perhaps. This is not going to work out because I'm going to hit the the ceiling bit. And yes, I agree, for Vashna, this game is a very creepy vibe that the other Elder Scrolls games, the later ones, did not capture. But I'm okay with that because I'm a pansy. Okay, well, we made it a lot of the way up. So that worked out somewhat well. No, we didn't. We made it a tiny bit of the way up. Okay, can I please... Okay, there we go. We got out of there. I guess I can't climb that yet. Just give you some love. It's not like... Oh, Saluchi. I don't know. A digit? Oh. Because you asked Algy for some love. I see. Good gravy. Good gravy, Saluchi. Good gravy. <laughs> good gravy. Oh my good gravy. Saluchi, please. Saluchi, please. Oh my god. Ah, oh, you mongrel. Oh god. Why did they die in such a sexual sounding manner? Okay, well that one's dead. I can't carry anything they have anyway. Oh god. This game! It's too stressful! I can't believe the voice recognition software understood that. Let me sleep, okay. Jumping, swimming and running improved. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it all the way to the bank. I'd rather take it home though because this is goddamn terrifying. 
Okay, out here. Uh, wait, we've already been here, haven't we? Oh. Uh, so we'll go back up here now. And just turn right. Yep. Okay. I really do not like this dungeon. This dungeon. Oh, well, not this way. So back up, and then, okay, to the right, and then to the left. This way, this way. Oh man, I was... Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, paralysis. You cannot restrain me, I have a shirt for that. Another portal. Second portal we've found. I do not like the portal. You love how I can just straight up climb walls. Yeah, I like it too. It's terribly glitchy in some instances though, but it works well most of the time. It's just like horses in Skyrim. People think they remove the climbing mechanics after these games, but it's actually still in there. In the form of horses. I wonder how horses are going to be in Elder Scrolls Online. And I wonder if they'll be glitchy as crap. Oh, that's okay. That loops back around to that. Oh, this continues on. Hmm, I wonder if I go hop. Aha! Oh, it's the. Oh! I'm back at the entrance. Okay. just save here. Right at the entrance. I know, Mikey Shadow. I know. Mounts in an MMO? What is this? Let's do this one. It's okay, I know where we're going now. I know where we want to go. I don't want to go there, but we're going to go there anyway. Oh, that just dropped me into here. Huh. Well, this is going to be a scary place. Sounds freaking goddamn. Oh, please stop. Please stop. Okay, if we right hand rule it, we'll get to a new spot. Good. Good, good, good. Let's actually go over to this one. Yeah, because I thought it would just be one room. Oh my god, why are the torture devices? Dead guys in cages and skeletal remains of people. Yeah, the horses in Skyrim weren't very fast. Uh, virulent pumpkin? Yeah. Don't post links, please, but... ElderScrollsOnline.com. Is that a real... I'm gonna, I'm gonna look that up. Yeah. Don't post links in my channel, please, because that could very well be some kind of spam link. Or, uh, or a virus, or whatever. Especially being such a catchy, you know... OMG! The Elder Scrolls Online NDA has been lifted. Wow. So I'd rather... You tell us that the NDA has been lifted. Uh, rather than posting links in my chat. And then we can all go look it up. And find out if that's true. It's no problem, Virulent, by the way. I'm not, not angry at you or anything. I know. But you should be aware that in many, many Twitch streams, chats, that'll be the rule. There are very few chats that freely let you post links. Very, very few. So... Whenever you go into a new channel, you should uh, ask the person if you're allowed to post a link first. Uh, 
Oh, okay, hello. Can I kill her in there? Oh, she can hit me too. I kind of want to kill her though. Put her out of her misery, at least. Okay, there we go. It was, uh, it was uh, an honorable killing. It was lifted yesterday, but no beta going on right now. I see. So people can post all their videos that they've been saving up. And play in the open beta as soon as it comes out. I wonder if I should play in open beta. Because what I was planning on doing... Was... Was waiting for the... Like, doing the Old Schools Marathon. And then as soon as, um... ESO releases for the five day early access I get comes out then I would start playing it streaming that and streaming you know stream that a few days a week and then stream uh, the Old Scrolls Marathon a few days a week and then um, also be playing with the Twitch Geeks on certain days of the week as well but um, I mean if it comes out early or if the, the I don't know should I play an open beta I really don't think I should I wonder. Or, or I'm in the I'm in the beta anyway because I pre-ordered the game. So, should I play in beta? I just don't know. What do you guys think? I guess we'll have to see when the when the next beta is coming live. Whether you guys want me to play in beta because I hmm, it's a tough decision. It's a tough decision. Because on the one hand. I don't want to ruin the experience for when the full game comes out. I don't want my full full game experience to be marred by saying, oh, and this is where the game crashed, and this is where there was incomplete content, and this is where the textures were missing, and this is where a glitch was. But on the other hand, if I don't stream it as soon as the beta comes out, I mean, other people are going to be streaming it, so they'll basically get a head start on everybody and if you guys wanted to watch it you'd go and watch you'd have to go and watch somebody else rather than watching me play it. I don't know. It's a very tough decision. So you guys you guys can basically decide for me I suppose and I'll put more thought into it as well. Might be good PR for Twitch geeks if we play uh, ESO during beta, yeah. It might be. Let's go all the way down here now. You saw someone streaming the closed beta today. Uh, but the beta servers aren't even up. So maybe they were streaming a pre-recorded video of it, I guess. If that's the case. Let's just uh, left hand up here. Um, no, this way. And then there's a secret door. Where? back here. Where is it? There it is. Can't pick up any of the money. How much money do I have on me? 28k. Good gravy. It was live. Yeah, but how do you know? Was he responding to people in chat? And what was he playing on if the beta server wasn't up? Hmm, I can go down there. If we hit... Right hand rule, alright. Wait. Did I go down this way yet? Yes, okay. Never mind then. Never mind then. Where are we headed? Where are we? Wait. There was another way down here, wasn't there? No, I'm an idiot. Uh, how do I get down here? Oh, that's, f that's a completely separate... Alright. That is a completely separate place. Well, this place isn't so bad, I guess. I don't think we've encountered any monsters that have been too... We've encountered one that was extremely powerful, right? One extremely powerful monster. And that's it. So, not so bad. 
Ah, that's how I get down. Okay. So I just go right up here. Shit. Curse it, man. Curse it. This way now? Yes, okay. And this way, and that way. And this way. Okay. That's the way around that gate. And then up here, and then to the left. Yes. Let's give the game a save here. Oh man, I am... I'm not only sweating from the heat, as I am. I don't know. I just don't know. Oh. I don't know. I wonder, because playing playing during the beta might get me more viewers. Might get me some new viewers, which is important. You always need to be bringing in new viewers. But. Oh, shit. But. If I play during the beta, it will mar my experience of the full game. And, if that happens, I'll be less inclined to play the full game for a long time. And I want to stream it for a good long time. I don't really want to ruin it early on. And then get sick of it after a month. I want to be streaming it for months. Not every day for months, but, you know, as a regular thing each week. Playing it a few times a week, or playing it with the Twitch geeks a few times a week, or whatever. I want that to be a really regular game of mine, so... Maybe playing it in beta is a bad idea. Okay, where are we? Where are we? Where are... shit. Why does that happen? Click down there and... Does something weird. Nothing over there. Ah, uh, is this... have we explored this? Yes. Fully explored it? Hmm, looks like it. Where's somewhere I haven't been? Perhaps down this way. Perhaps this way? This way? Perhaps way over here there's something. Maybe. Not really looking like it, but... The character models in ESO are so nice looking. I agree. Yes, I agree about the Imperials being behind a paywall being BS2. Honestly, something like the Imperials, where you, should, where you can play in uh, any class, or any race, or you can play it in any in any faction, you should have to get a character to max level before you unlock the Imperials. Here's where I need to go. You should have to get one character to max level to unlock the Imperials. It should be an achievement in the game to get them. If they want to have something like the Imperials in there. That's what I think would be best. Let's go... Down here, then to the right. Uh, Dallas, you're saying that twice. <laughs> I know you're trying to get through the twi Twitch Kraken, but... Just... I think the best idea is to send it once, wait to see if it goes through. And then if it doesn't, send it again. Alright, this is where I need to get. So we just go down this way. Then this way, right? No. This way. Then... Through this one. Okay. ESO looks terrible. Visually, I entirely disagree. Gameplay-wise, you ha must have not have seen the PvP. Either that or you just don't like it, but damn, is it amazing PvP. Oh, is this... this is a blank wall. Shit. Well... My map. Um, oops. There was a section over here that I haven't been to, right? Over this way? It was over by... By this thing? Maybe up. Yes, over there, okay. So I need to go around there. Um... Ah, and then down to the end of the corridor. So if I just turn around, go up this thing, I'll be... Much closer to it. Okay. The armor in ESO is not the best, but it is very good. Uh. 
this is the wrong way. Other way. All the way down here. You just wanted a beer? What do you mean, Salucci? An ESO? <laughs> is that what you're talking about? Or in real life? I know you like beer in real life. Uh, maybe we should just go through the portal. No, we shouldn't. That's going to bugger everything up. I'll come back to this portal, maybe. But for now, we need to go... Ah, there's a new section right over here. This will be a good place to explore, then. And that's the beginning. It's easy to locate, at least. So let's just go forward and then around to the right. Hmm, interesting. Let's save and then attempt to climb this. You love how it's fully voiced? Yes, I entirely agree. Armor looks like fat rolls. I don't agree with that. Okay, see you later, Algy. I don't know how that's supposed to be offensive. You say no offense. Like, it's not an offensive thing. It's just your opinion. But I do think that opinion is wrong. Obviously, everybody's going to perceive the armor differently. And it is un... un oh, I can climb like that. I didn't know that that was possible. It is unfortunate that they couldn't go for full polygon armor. And a shot there with that bear? What? Who was like that, Salucci? Not algae. Not algae. What is this? Secret door? Huh. And we're back to an explored place. Well, let's turn around. Right. Yes, this is where we want to go. Because there was that other unexplored place. Then we can go back to one of those portals. If we can find them again. At least we're not hearing the monster noises so much anymore. Because we've killed most of them. The bar manager. Oh. Bar managers in real life pressure you to have more alcohol? I'm pretty sure that's illegal in New Zealand. <laughs> but now I'm starting to see why Finns are all constantly drinking alcohol. That's just the culture over there. Uh, down and then over this way, okay. To the west. And we haven't been this way, okay. Oh! I like the peace of when you've killed everything in a place. Where'd that guy go? Oh well. Nothing. In the dungeon. What? I have no idea what you mean by that virulent pumpkin. It's not illegal if the customer says yes. Yeah, but pressuring somebody into drinking alcohol. He was like, you will have this shot. And you're like, no. He's like, yes, you will drink this shot. And you're like, no. And he's like, yeah, have this shot. And you're like, oh, okay. Pretty sure you're not allowed to do that in New Zealand. Oh, my. Oh. By my ebony sword, you will die. Something hanging over there, a dead corpse hanging there, wow, in a cage. Oh! Good God. Well, that's a sharp drop. Have we been down there? Yes, that's the place where I tried to climb. He already was, he was already, wait, he was already making you the drink when you said yes. Well. I don't understand. Was he going to give it to you for free? Is that what you mean? Obviously, as long as you're happy with taking the drink, there's nothing wrong with it, really. But pretty sure you're not allowed to pressure, as a bartender, pressure people into drinking more alcohol. In New Zealand. Who knows what it is in, in Finland. No, he wasn't offering it to you for free. <laughs> I 
guess you like shots more than I do then. I'd just be like, bugger you. Bugger you, man. Bugger you, I didn't want that shot. He was gonna make you pay. He made you the shot and was gonna make you pay after you'd already told him no. Then I'd just leave the place. I'd complain to the manager and leave. To be perfectly honest, but obviously you probably have a good relationship with that person and all that. But yeah, I would totally just leave that place. <laughs> just leave and, and say, screw this guy. Elven Claymore. Too bad I don't use Claymores on this character. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. Too close. Too close. Get personal space. Have you never heard of personal space? Thank you. I can't pick up any of this stuff. I don't know why I search the corpses anymore. The one weakness that you could see happening with ESO is that since it's an MMO trying to be as close to a generic Elder Scrolls game as possible, it'll end up feeling like a low-budget Skyrim. I hope that doesn't happen, but I definitely think that is not going to happen, Dallas Cheese fan. And the reason is because of the PvP. Sure, the the there's certain elements that people loved in Skyrim that are in ESO are not going to be as strong as they were in Skyrim like the single player aspects right like the radiant or not radiant but the random uh, quests that you find like you're out and about and then a t talking dog comes up to you they're not going to be as strong in ESO but there's massive 200 person PvP battles that you couldn't have in Skyrim. In the Siege of Whiterun, there was like five guys coming and charging, and they're like, Ah! The Stormcloaks are here! Charge! And there's like five Stormcloaks versus five Imperials. It was really pathetic. So that's going to be amazing. In ESO, with 200 real people all charging at each other, swinging their swords. It's going to be absolutely amazing. And it's something that Skyrim absolutely failed at. So it's not just going to be online Skyrim. It's going to take elements of Skyrim and do them alright. And it's going to make its own elements or elements that Skyrim did poorly and do them amazingly. Like that one. They've got siege equipment. You can set up siege weapons. You can bring siege weapons and bust down castles with them. It's friggin' epic. And there was nothing like that in Skyrim. Nothing at all. She was inside me. I think we're supposed to have it the other way around, but, you know, whatever works. <laughs> oh, man. Maybe with vampires it's a little different. I need to go back down there now, because there was another pathway. Where am I hearing this guy? Somewhere in there. Ah. Well, that's weird. Huh. Else do we have to explore in here? You're off to bed? Okay, see you later, Phantom. S have a good one. Sleep well. And all that. What else do we say? I don't remember. Okay, that. Oh, yes! Puzzle time! Yes! That's a good point. What time is it for me? It's uh, 1 45 pm. And it's blistering hot. In the middle of the day. You love the entire open world aspect of ESO, exploring the entire continent of Tamriel. Yes. The, the thing is, though, there is a slight problem. Each, uh, like, section is going to be invisible walled off, so you have to do, like, auto-traveling between some of the locations. But each location will be fully explorable, which will be awesome. The problem with PvP in an RPG game is how hard it is to balance. You get into the whole, X build is OP, nerf it, nerf it, and something else is OP. 
I don't think that's so bad. I really don't think that's that bad. And you're going to have, with massive battles like that, you're going to have to have a decent ba uh, balance on your team rather than just a balance on your personal characters. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, shit. I was a fool. You were a fool to confront me. And now I have paid the ultimate price. Blasted? Blast it, blast it, blast it. Where are we? I don't want to... Well, we need to kill him. We need to kill him. So open it up. Thank you guys for the... The fool comment! I was a fool! You were a fool to confront me! And now I have paid the ultimate oh. price! No, no, Dallas Chiefs fan. Dallas Chiefs fan. From Chaden Hall to Bruma, you can you can walk that distance. But I think the difference is when you're in Cyrodiil, if you get to the edge of Cyrodiil, instead of just walking to Skyrim, you have to, you know, go to the map or whatever and travel to Skyrim. And then you can travel through all of Skyrim without anything. And then, But if you want to go from Skyrim to Ellswear, you can't walk from point A to point B. You have to travel there. So... I think that's going to be how it is, but it's still going to be a massive, massive open exploration, explorable world. And it's going to be extremely fun, and that's a pretty serious glitch right there, I think. Okay, we're fixed. We're fine. Oh, this guy is so strong. Lisa. Oh! I was a fool! You were a fool to confront me, and now have paid the ultimate price! Ah! Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Yeah, I need an alt tab for, for just a second here. Good god, this game. These freaking creatures. So tough. Do the main quest, he said. You can do it, they said. Okay. 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 Come on. There we go. I think it's because I died with the spell thing open. Hey, ugh, Mexican noodles, welcome. I think you've been here already, but obviously chat isn't working or you've been lurking. Maybe they could take away the invisible walls at some point. Maybe. Maybe. But they'll have to work out a system of loading between the worlds, if that's the case. No, 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 no. No. I was a fool. You were a fool to confront me. And hey, Mr. Evil, welcome. Oh man. Oh man. I need to kill this guy. Yeah, he blasts me so hard though. If you catch my drift. Yes. I was a fool! You were a fool to confront me! And now have paid the ultimate price!
Maybe I can s just not just not go to him. Hold on, let's just. What? Oh, that's on or off. Okay. Hopefully, he didn't get out of his cage there. Okay. And this is opened up. Okay, I made it through. Hello. That's the way. I made it through, so I'm not even gonna. Okay, see you later, Remimi Primus. Good luck. I look really stressed, unorthodox, I am. This dungeon. It's, it's both the heat, I'm extremely hot, if you catch my drift. And, um. Oh my god! Boom! How did I live? I lived and he died from my spell resistance, I think. I think I resisted his spells and that power killed him. That's what happened in Arena if you resist spells, the enemy, the cast it takes damage. Oh, it's a rat. That's okay. I can kill that. Please don't spawn any more enemies. Another rat. Why? Why bother me? Let me fully heal, please. Okay. Save the game. Man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. How much money is that? 1500 gold and I just have to leave it. <gasps> wow, this is the witch. That's a much less witchy witch than I thought we would find. Hello. Greetings, Miyamoto. I am Midora Dereni, former sorceress to the court of Daggerfall. I have an interest in helping you in your aim to exorcise the spirit of King Lysandus, but I can do little in my present circumstances. If you would pay a visit to, the cer to a certain other sorceress, I can lift the curse on Dereni Tower. Will you do this for me, Miyamoto? Yes. I will be in your debt, Miyamoto no Nulfaga. Ah, uh, Miyamoto. Nulfaga, the mother of my former Lord Lysandus, is a renowned mystic but I have heard whispers that the loss of her son has turned her mad with grief. If this is not true, she can help. She can and will help me. I need a certain rare item, the horn of a great unicorn, to break the curse on Dereni Tower. If Nulfaga is indeed mad, you must search her castle for this horn yourself and bring it back to me. I expect you back in 87 days. Okay, does that add it to the quest thing? Good. Okay, guys. Um, I'm going to save the game here. And we are going to exit. And we are going to go raid somebody. OP Nerd is about to start his stream, guys. He's about to start. So we're going to get there before he starts.